Hello? Oh, hello guys. Welcome to our channel. I didn't see you there. It took me by surprise. This is your regular dose of raw news and analysis. And before I move on to any further details on today's raw topic, I'd love to say a huge thank you for always supporting the channel. And in case you guys, God forbid, haven't subscribed yet, then please make sure you do or we'll come in for you. And also press that notification bell because we don't want you guys to miss out on any of the upcoming raw news and analysis over the next few weeks and months. So let's get started today on today's epic video. Now, friends of the Royals have said the family would be hugely concerned if reports of difficulties in Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's marriage turned out to be accurate. Now, as finding a role for a divorced or separated Harry, who decided to return to the UK would be a bloody nightmare. However, the friends have emphasised that reports alleging the couple are struggling all appear to be groundless and based on speculation a friend of williams told the daily beast william and kate had plenty of reservations about the marriage in the first place precisely because they feared that megan wasn't right for harry but what's done is done and now william like everyone else is in the family just hopes it all works out harry returning to the uk and trying to find him a job would be a bloody nightmare now, a friend of the King Charles told the Daily Beast the marriage has to work. That's not a case of Charles saying Harry made his bed and has to lie in it. It's a case of a father wanting his son, who loves, who he loves very, very much, to be happy and to have his wife and children in his life. These stories are groundless anyway. I don't think anyone is seriously concerned that they are on the point of separation. Now, rumours that the marriage might be in trouble first started to circulate after reports surfaced that Harry was spending occasional nights away from home, staying at the exclusive San Vincent Bungalows resort in Los Angeles. The rumour mill was stoked by Princess Diana's former butler, Paul Burrell, who said in an interview with GB News, am I the only person in the UK that is thinking, has Harry finally woken up to the truth? Has he finally seen the truth of what his wife is doing and that he's been brainwashed and mesmerised by her beauty or something? Because we all know that, but he doesn't seem to see it. Burrell was cut off by William and Harry after he published a memoir in 2003 entitled A Royal Duty, William and Harry. Unusually issued a joint statement at the time condemning the book as cold and overt betrayal. The royal author, Lady Colin Campbell, who is known to have excellent society contacts and was the first journalist to reveal Diana's eating disorder, also told GB News that she had heard from five reliable sources that Harry called in the lawyers some months ago. Reports of growing distance between the couple were also fueled by Meghan's absence from her husband's side as he promoted his memoir earlier this year. Now, when the couple did finally appear together at a New York award ceremony, whoo, their re-emergence was overshadowed by claims that they were involved in a car chase, the allegedly perilous nature of which they had appeared to exaggerate. However, the journalist Petronella Wyatt wrote in the Daily Telegraph this week that she believed the couple would never, ever split up, citing friends of mine in LA who know Harry and Meghan socially. So guys, what do you think about the news? Do you think that Harry and Meghan will break up? Do you think Harry desperately wants to return to his family after everything that happened? Please share your thoughts in the comments. Let us know what you think. And we'll see you again soon, guys, for more raw news and analysis. Bye for now.